Sam, from the moment I double waved at you at Frothy Monkey, I knew my heart was a goner. It didn't take you long to figure out how to make me happy, and I know you'll never stop searching for ways to make me smile. There's something beautiful in the quiet we have found. I have a new command I give you, that you love one another as I have loved you. We will go as far as our feet can take us. Heaven knows the world that we will find. It's been for as long as I can remember. We actually recently debated this. I was convinced that we had been best friends since we were eight, and Addie insisted that we were six, so as our arguments have historically gone, I was wrong and Addie was definitely right. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what she put me through in those first two years that made me feel like I needed to block it out, but whatever it was, we got past it and we've been inseparable ever since. Addison June Nighter, I promise to love you unconditionally for as long as you will have me. I promise to listen to you, to never rush to judgment, and to understand the best to the best of my ability each and every day. Um, I first got to meet Addie just a few weeks after her and Sam uh, started dating. Uh, Sam and I were living together at the time, and Addie would come over um, just to hang out. Um, and she used to always bring bagels. And we would always ask her to say the word bagel because she said it way differently than we did. <laughs> so something I knew first when I met Addie, right, was if you know anything about Sam, right, he'll argue with the wall. Um, and Addie had, some, Addie had some way of countering that, um, which I'm not sure how she does it still, um, but she does a great job. Um, Addie, little did we know that day you swiped right on Sam would be the start of something so beautiful. Um, you can see how clearly happy you make Sam, how incredible you two are together. As far as your feet can take us, heaven knows the world that we will find. We'll paint the open sky, illuminate the night, you and I. Stars overhead turn my head and I caught you by eye for the first time. My life to serve, look no further, I'm finally found something to hold on to. So the first thing that happened uh, Eddie came to me and asked me to marry her. Marry them? I was excited, but she gave me a she gave me a list. <laughs> this is a list of things I can't talk about. <laughs> so, so we'll put that aside right now. I'm going to put that over here for later. <laughs> so those are the things. Uh, it, it was awesome. She wanted this. She wanted to reflect the love. That's what she wanted. She didn't mind me being a zillion Steve, but she wanted love to come forward. Is that fair, Eddie? So that's what we're doing today. Samuel, <laughs> this ring I give you, this ring I give you is, a is a constant reminder of my abiding love and commitment.
And I just want a message to go out to Sam and Addie uh, that a couple of really simple things about your marriage. Uh, number one, if you put God at the center of your marriage, you're going to be okay. And number two, just remember, your spouse is your best friend and they will always have your back. And that simple combination will make things work out for you. You'll get through just about anything. Render all.